everybody and welcome back. This is Mr. Warlock FTW. I just made it stop raining because it was raining when I loaded it up and I wanted it to be a clear day when I started this. So we're going to start up where we left off. Um, we're going to do the quest that's uh, uh, with that Daedra. Um, Jamora just popped in and said he wanted to talk to a Mozabale and me. I mean Dagon wanted to. But this is totally against the lore and all that, but who cares? Um, let's see. Where is it? It was started to. Uh, let me find it. No, not the arena. Origins of Great Prince. Uh, spirits have least, No. Okay, where is it? Problem with Kier. Here it is. A Dramora has contacted me and told me Lord Dagon wishes to speak to me. I am to travel to his temple at once. Okay. I'll say, okay, it's right there. So, we're probably going to have to use the dragon. Uh, first, I'm going to go to some place, you know, close by. Like the stables. Or I'll just summon the horses for with a Mozabale in me. That'll be better. Ah, okay. I guess it'll be raining while we run it. Alright, I don't know if I showed these before. Let's see, where is the other one? Oh, there he is. Alright, this is my horse. And tell him to mount the horse. Alright. Just gonna start running. Alright, now. Um, and these are pretty cool horses. They're on fire. They're like, they're called nightmares, but, I mean, normally. But, um, they're made by Alien Slaw, you know, the modder that I rave about a lot. Uh, let me go down this mountain a little bit slower. They're really fast. Uh, there's a dangerous portal. Let me go around that so I don't have to get the weird, uh, sky. And I think these horses are immortal, so they can't die. They're kind of like the horse you get with the Dark Brotherhood. Uh, okay, how do you like the, uh, the, um, Borderlands Let's Play I'm doing? It's, uh, I had a few problems in the beginning because of the, you know, not being able to hear myself, but other than that, I think it's pretty cool. I was going to do Borderlands, but there's some mods on there I have to change around so it can, uh... I'm not Borderlands. I was going to do Fallout 3. Um... There's some mods I wanted to, uh, change around. Oops. Okay. Okay, I'll just fight him. Actually, these Dremore horses are actually pretty strong. Come on, I'm about to bail. See? Alright, get back on your horse, I'm about to bail. Uh, he'll like walk slowly to his horse. The only thing I don't really care for, I mean, he could run, he's way over there. Let's see how close we are. Alright, we're slightly closer, about halfway. Alright, let's continue. <coughs> now the flames kind of go away if you try to fast travel with the horses, so... Oh, the rain is finally dissipating. And these horses can run up on uh, the side of a mountain pretty easily. I like it. Uh, almost 
there. This is a custom made world, just like the uh, Bolivian uh, place where I found a Mozabale in. It, it, later on you get to rule over this plane of Oblivion. Kind of, let's see. Alright, let's get off the horse. Wait for Mozabale. He should be coming anyway. Come on! Can't be that slow. Well, it takes... Here, I'll just wait for him. One hour. Should make him come here. No? Okay, I'll fast travel here. That'll teleport any companions to you. There we go. Let's have him dismiss the horses. Not dismount. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh man, did I just make him remove all inventory? Uh, dang. I don't know what it... Okay, that's weird. Uh, access inventory... Wait, he's supposed to have it... Why does he still have his armor on if he's... Never mind. Uh, dismiss. Danger force. Does he have a double face glitch or something? No, he doesn't. Okay, let's go in. I'm gonna save it here just in case it glitches. Hold on. Okay, there's Michael Warlock. And continue from here. This is Dagon's temple. It's like a lost shrine because there's always all the other Daedric Lords have like a temple outside. He has one underneath the ground that was made here. It's kind of weird that the sky is not... that's usually Daedric cloudy sky, but I guess that one mod that changes uh, weather makes it so it's normal. Anyway. Okay, let's do this. Well, well, you finally arrived. Hope I'm not inconveniencing you. I have a task you and Amozabale may be interested in. It involves Kier, and I'm sure you would both like a little revenge. Kier has become a thorn in my side, always trying to undermine my authority and spreading dissension among the ranks. He's become very powerful and has a loyal group of followers. I could take him down, but those loyal to him would spite me for it. This is where you and Mozabeo come in. The two of you could infiltrate his tower home and strike him down in front of his men. Seeing him defeated in this way would truly make them aware that Kier is not the all-powerful warlord they perceive him as. It may even shift their loyalty to the two of you. This would mean that you would control his men and take possession of everything on the island. When you and Amozabale are up to the task, step through the Oblivion Gate. It will transport you to Kier's Island in the Deadlands. Make your decision quickly. Time is growing short and my patience is wearing thin. <coughs> now be gone, and don't come back to me unless you have completed this task. Very well. Enough talk. Hold on, let me set my timer real quick. I'll set it to... Oh, there, okay. Uh, now let's go through the portal. Wait, he does have the double face glitch, doesn't he? Yeah, he does. I think that's why he still has his armor. Uh, because I made him actually get rid of his armor. 